It, it happens in our in Catholic Christian circles and our Protestant brother circles. Somehow the idea is that the more successful they are, the more God has blessed us. That's a fallacy. It doesn't mean be, God has blessed us because that, uh, the, I mean, we can thank God for it. But the issue is, as we embrace the moment, sometimes we make very good decisions. But it isn't that somehow, because you're open to God, you're going to be wealthy, and somehow you're open to God, but you're not going to be wealthy. So what happened? Gee, why? No. It's that the real success in life is finding this deep union with God. It makes no difference whether we're wealthy or poor. But quite often in life, when we embrace what we have to face, we make good decisions, and probably life goes a lot better. But... It doesn't always mean that. You all have friends who've died. You've all have parents who've died. Uh, we have children who die. So life is not a utopia. But God is always with us to draw us closer. Heaven begins now or it doesn't begin. See, heaven begins now. In the moment, heaven is an encounter with God. And it starts at this very moment. Right at this moment. And as we embrace that, then when it comes time to our final transition, it's a lot easier where there's no more limitations. But it starts now. So, God is alive and present in every moment of our life. Every moment is to deepen our experience of God, of love. And that's what's powerful.